overview of the BSL Scotland Bill and associated documents. Four main documents have been produced in connection with the BSL Scotland Bill. Each document has a BSL summary or overview and a full BSL version that will be split into sections. The four documents and BSL videos are the BSL Scotland Bill itself, the Policy Memorandum, the Explanatory Notes and Statements on Legislative Competence and the Financial Memorandum, which appears in the written documents alongside the Explanatory Notes and the presiding officers and members' statements. Here is a short summary of the contents of each BSL version. Explanatory Notes The explanatory notes are not part of the bill, but should be read or watched at the same time as the bill. They give an overview of the BSL Scotland Bill and provide an explanation of each section of the bill. Statements on legislative competence. The documents include statements from the member who introduced the bill, Mark Griffin, MSP, and the presiding officer of the Scottish Parliament the Right Honourable Tricia Marwick, MSP. On the power of the Scottish Parliament to legislate on the matters dealt with in the Bill. Financial Memorandum. This provides an overview of the best estimates of the administrative and other costs in relation to the bill. Please refer to the text version of the financial memorandum to see the footnotes that accompany this document. Policy memorandum. The Policy Memorandum outlines what the BSL Scotland Bill aims to promote, British Sign Language and the development of BSL plans by the Scottish Ministers and Public Authorities and how these are reviewed, reported on and updated. The Memorandum also outlines more details of the Bill such as Specific duties on the Scottish Ministers Duties on listed authorities The plans and timescales The consultation undertaken Promotion of BSL as a language Equality of access to services Alternative approaches and the effects on equal opportunities, human rights, island communities, local government, sustainable development, etc. Please refer to the text version of the policy memorandum to see the footnotes that accompany this document. The BSL Scotland Bill The BSL Scotland Bill is split into three main parts, each with subsections. The first part of the Bill 
sets out the requirements for a British Sign Language National Plan for Scotland and for certain public authorities to prepare and publish their own British Sign Language plans. It covers special responsibility assigned to a cabinet secretary or minister, listed authorities that have to prepare plans, publication of plans by listed authorities, performance review of plans, special provision where there is early dissolution of the Parliament, alteration of the date of publication of a plan review, the meaning of listed authority and other expressions, the commencement date, when the legislation will come into force, and the short title of the bill. Schedule 1 gives information on special provision where early dissolution of the Parliament takes place. Schedule 2 lists the public authorities referred to in the Bill.